Once the city used to pulse with energy, dirty and dangerous, but alive and wonderful. Now, it's something else. The changes came slowly at first. Most didn't realize or didn't care and accepted them. They chose a comfortable life. Some didn't. And those who refused to conform were pushed to the sidelines, criminalized. They became our clients. We call ourselves runners. We exist on the edge, between the gloss and the reality. The mirror's edge. We keep out of trouble, out of sight, and the cops don't bother us. Runners see the city in a different way. We see the flow. Rooftops become pathways and conduits, possibilities, and routes of escape. The flow is what keeps us running, keeps us alive. Train of time, Faith. Yeah, I know you hate it, but that fall took you out of commission for a while. And now you're back, you gotta keep sharp, especially in this city. Check out these new training grounds, pretty slick, huh? So let's not run around duty, so get to her and just go with the flow, okay? Welcome to the Mirror's Edge video walkthrough of the training mission from nextgenwalkthroughs.com. In case you were confused about the training mission. It is training. We are here to help you. Mm -hmm. So basically this, this guide is on the hard difficulty and it's going to do no shots fired on enemies, uh, which gets you an achievement of like 80 points. I don't know. Think so, so soon. it's gonna is, be awesome. Is the training mission more difficult because it's on hard? No. Uh, I just posted it, so I what, don't what makes the hard game. difficulty more hard? Um, <clears throat> you see how the shit you're supposed to do turns red? Yeah. It doesn't turn red in the new uh, in but the it's hard red right now. Well, in this is training. Uh, they don't expect you to know that. In the hard difficulty, it doesn't turn red, so you really gotta know where you're going. Otherwise, you can get lost. Is the hard difficulty unlockable? Yeah. I hate unlockable difficulties. Yeah, it's annoying. <laughs> anyway, that's my two cents. Yeah, especially if you do a lot of the speed runs and time trials, you're ready for the hard difficulty after, you know, not even completing the game. Mm -hmm. um, so, I don't know why they do it, but they do. Two. What's the word I'm looking for? Artificially increase the replay value of the game. That's why they add unlockable difficulties. Yeah, yeah, I could see that, but I feel like this game, I mean, it's a short game, but it's got a lot of replay value. It's almost like a racing game. Like, there's different tracks, and there's different ways you can go. So if you're into, like, speed runs and stuff like that, this is a, you can sink a lot of time. I'm not saying that's why this game added unlockable difficulties. I'm saying that's why most games yeah. add, unlock add unlockable difficulties to artificially increase replay value. Which oh. is such a bullshit way. Oh! Mass Effect. Don't get me started on Mass Effect. Yeah, see that really <laughs> sucks. You have to put like, you know, 30 hours in to get to the next difficulty. Whereas uh -huh. this, you know, you could probably beat it in 6 to 8. Mm -hmm. So it's not too bad. So yeah, um, basically controls you're going to be using. Um, right bumper is jump, right trigger is dive, um, so that's kind of a unique You mean left scheme. bumper or left, left trigger? That's what I do mean. <laughs> okay. I'm a little disoriented right now, I've been playing too much. Right bumper is 180 turn, and right trigger is attack. And then Y is disarm, X is slow-mo. And then you pull left trigger as you're jumping to pull up your knees, right? To do kind of a little crouch jump. Yeah. If you're familiar with like Halo or Call of Duty or something like that. Yeah. Or I guess Call of Duty crouch jumps. And then so you do um, yeah, lots of wall runs and then you can turn Merc jump. Run you some There's spars. some pretty big combos you, know you can get. You ready? Um, okay, I'll point them on. out as we go. Like, 
punch hit kick combos or like, or like uh, wall run turn jump kick or oh so All like right, wall Par run parkour turn parkour combos yeah disarms. that's cool just in case uh, so disarming from behind is automatic. Disarming from the front, uh, you have to wait till the gun turns red. Remember what I taught you, Faith. Ninety percent of the guns are pretty easy to disarm, fight. but the SWAT team carries these automatic guns uh, that are pretty difficult to disarm because you have to. You don't hit Y right away. You they like swing and then I don't know. I struggle with it. So yeah, slow mo is That's helpful. That's what slow motion's for. Yeah. Right? yeah. But you only get it once, so if there's multiple guys, it becomes difficult. So that was the training okay, in our, our training, intro. Ladies. Gotta get to the real thing. That was our training, Faith, ladies. Yourself, so check get to the me. real thing. Faith, let me Woo. know when you're ready to get going. See you later, Faith. 